Hey everybody, Pop Shred here. Well, here in Alberta, it looks like we hit ourselves a cold front. So instead of complaining about it, we decided to take advantage of that cold weather and we're building ourselves a nice climbing tower. So stick around and I'll show you what I'm doing. Well, it's January 2021. Surviving throughout the pandemic and uh, in Calgary here, a lot of the uh, hockey teams aren't allowed to play hockey anymore. So we have people all over Calgary building hockey rinks in their backyard. And then the, the weather, the weather here, we're having a cold spell and well, Pop Shred, he decided instead of building a nice rink in the background, backyard sorry let's uh let's build an ice climbing tower so here we go this here is about a 25 foot 30 foot ice tower that is in construction right now i started putting water on it just the other day and uh here's the one side Here's the other side. We're starting to uh, starting to coat the top, and uh, I think probably about the next three four days, I think we're gonna have ourselves a pretty solid ice climbing wall. All right, so we're started. Got rid of the trampoline. Put her over there on the old skate park. Uh, Rip some two by fours in half, and uh, we're gonna start building the A-frame for the ice tower. Now, it might look cold out here. It's because it is. All right, so we're just building the uh, the ice pyramid base right now uh, this is what she's looking at there's nothing fancy about it and then uh, I get my snow fence tomorrow we'll wrap it all around give something for that ice to uh, adhere to uh, so I think by tomorrow evening I should uh, be able to start uh, building ice all right let's go All right, so my neighbor just looked out her door. I think she thinks I'm a little mentally deranged. Like, uh, what's a guy doing in the middle of the cold, building a giant pyramid? All right, finally get to work in the daytime. So what we got here is I built the frame, um, and then we're gonna cover it in snow fence. And I think tonight we'll be able to start uh, making some ice. So here we go, this is where we're at so far. That's the top, comes this way, all the way down. So right now, I think it's at about 25, maybe 30 feet to start off the, uh, the pyramid of ice. Nice. 
All right, day two ice building. Let's go check out, see how we're doing. Oh, there she is. She's looking good. I ran out of uh, snow fence, so you can see I was trying to fill up the gaps with some spare two by fours and pieces of wood. I think it should work out all right. She hasn't fallen down yet. I thought we'd have to make uh, the ice come all the way to the ground to give it the uh, support that she needs, but I think she's doing okay. She's not going to uh, hopefully come down. Generally, I think probably in the next four days, probably have a pretty good solid ice climb. What do you think? Yeah, all right. All right, so I bought a nozzle from Lee Valley. It's like a Mr. Nozzle. And you can see it mists that water really nice. That pressure drop causes the temperature to drop and it helps freeze the, uh, the water pretty quick. I started with uh, freezing the bottom wanted to get a good solid base. Now I'm working my way up. Once the whole thing's got a good coat of ice on it, we'll just keep adding to it. Not too sure what my water bill is gonna be like, but uh, probably gonna be pretty high. Uh, don't tell mom. See ya. I like building ice towers, ice towers, ice towers. I like building ice towers, don't you? All right, let's see where we're at. Starting to build some more ice, looking good. All right, she's getting cold out, making a bunch of ice. Getting better and better every hour. Whew. Getting excited. Hey guys, just whipped home from uh, work over lunch hour to see how the ice making's going. And she is looking good. Check this out. This is, uh, she's starting to develop nicely on this side. We got some overhangs. That might be a little tough to climb. This side's getting not too bad. And we're spraying on this side right now. You can see, we really start building up there and pretty soon we'll finish in the base here and then I'll be working on the top trying to get this thing higher and higher. All right, we're gonna give it a little swing test, see how, uh, how solid the ice is. So, oh, that's solid. Got a lot of nice steps. That's good. Nice. Solid. She's gonna be fun. So if you guys have any questions or uh, thoughts or uh, maybe you can give me some advice, maybe you built one of these before, uh, please let me know in the comments and I'll get right back to you. All right, talk to you later. Come on, girls. Dad, it's good, but it just needs to be bigger. Okay. All right, stay tuned for part two of the ice climbing tower. We uh, should have it out probably next week. We're gonna uh, set up a top rope and see what this ice tower is made of. What's it like to actually climb this beast? See you then.